This video will show you how to add notifications on your web page. And a notification is one such as this one that's been added to alert our viewers um, of a bus cancellation um, for our district. We do this by logging in. You don't need to be on your home page in order to do that. And this time we're going to click on notification. Now notifications, when we click on there, there are three different types of notifications that can be created. So if I click on this notification um, icon over here, you can see that there is a general notification that is displayed in green. An alert, such as the one that we just saw as a bus notification, that might be one um, for buses or um, for specific notifications that might be up and down quickly. And then emergency um, are displayed in red and that might be a lockdown or um, uh, some type of emergency event that has us occurred at the school or at the district level. So once we access our notification page. Here's our editing page which is exactly the same as the other ones that we have seen. So I am just going to recreate that bus cancellation. And I'm going to provide my viewers with some information here. And this is where maybe we don't provide and add as much information as we have with our posts and our events. We don't really need an image or a link or to make this fancy. We don't need to add any links or pictures to our sidebar right here. So this is basically the inf all the information that we need in the body of our text. We now go over to our sidebar. We indicate what type of notification this is going to be. This is going to be alert, so it's going to be displayed in yellow or the amber color. This is where we want, this is our display date. So when is it going to be starting to display and when do we want it to be ending? So this is just going to end at the end of today because it's just a notification for today. So I'm going to say today at 3 p.m. Topics and CEO, I wouldn't worry too much about that, but you could add that if you want. We don't need any links or attachments or pictures, and we want to share this to our school page. So again, you are not going to see all this list. Um, click your notification. And again, if you want to add it to your social media feed, this is where you have the opportunity to do so. Publish it so your public sees it. Notifications are displayed in your scheduler, so we can go in our scheduler and double check that it is there. So I'm going to select my home page. I'm going to open up my notifications and I can see that my bus cancellation is there and that it starts immediately and ends today. If you had more than one, this is where you could stack them and rearrange them so that um, they would be in a different order. And let's go see if it's displayed on our homepage yet. I did have to hit the refresh in order to see it, but it is displayed. It's displayed in the yellow or the amber color because it is an alert. It's not a general information and it's not um, emergency.